And your thoughts on the start of the season, Carl? Uh, they've gone um, reasonably well. Uh, obviously, really wanted to get the win up at Newcastle, uh, as anyone would. But, you know, you beat Harlequins at home and it was a great victory, but we really wanted to back that up and go away and, uh, and ram those points home. Uh, but other than that, like you say, Rob says about the big picture, we, ha we have picked up uh, a good amount of points in these first, uh, first block of Premiership games, uh, which has been great. Um, and obviously with Irish coming down this weekend, we've got a home match and hopefully go into the, uh, the European and LV block um, with a re really, really good bunch of results behind us. Yeah, how important would it be to go to four and two as opposed to three and three, as it were? Yeah, hugely important. I mean, the points add up and the start of the year, if you can really, really get them in uh, as they start adding up come, come the end. I know it sounds silly, but it's the truth. Uh, you don't want to be scrapping for them later on. You want to make sure you've, you've done the work, got the, uh, got the wins. Uh, and especially the home wins. Uh, and this place should be a fortress for us, and that's how we want it to be. So, as players, how far ahead do you look? Because you know we sort of know in the next group of fixtures, uh, Northampton, Bath, and Saris. Do you go through the fixture list and go, this one's? There? Honestly, BMA. Uh, some players wouldn't even know we were playing a fortnight down the way. To be honest with you, it's a very much a week by week thing here. Uh, and playing wise, it has to be because. You know, we, you know, there's battles for selection, battles for wins and losses and stuff like that. And really, you are one-track minded, thinking about the weekend coming up. Um, I don't think many people will be looking a week ahead at, at any stage because, yeah, you have to have all your focus in on one game at one time. What are you expecting from Irish? Because they've shown this season they're capable of beating anyone on their day. Yeah, they're really good. Uh, I think it's, it's starting to come together for them this year. Um, you know, the, the last couple of seasons probably a bit disappointing for them um, with where they wanted to be. But no, they're certainly um, not shy this year. They, they had a really good start to the year. Watching them, they look, you know, pretty, pretty good in all areas. To be honest with you, and it is going to be tough to find to find some weaknesses, but. Yeah, uh, they're still beatable, as, as they have beaten this year, and uh, we're looking to, to bring them down here and, and do the same. And personally, have you your own form? Yeah, uh, yes, it started off, obviously, I, I was in at the start of the year and it was gone well, but since uh, dropping out, Mooney's been playing very well as well, and, I've, and I respect that. Uh, I'm just happy to still be in, in, in the team and uh, always making a push to try and get back in the, back in the starting lineup. Third game on the new playing surface out there. Have you found it so far? It's brilliant. It's it's a really good, really good surface. I mean, time will tell. English English winter will tell whether it will hold up, but I'm sure it will. Uh, yeah, it, it's it's lovely, lovely surface to play at. The ground, obviously, the the extra crowd numbers. You can hear that on a Saturday and a Sunday, and uh, yeah, it's really, really nice to play. Here.